makes me crazy I dream about a baby Gazing on days and contagious You're my baby We know each other like the back of our hands Understand there's no mistake And I'm taking this you my dream We're ready? Absolutely. All right, go ahead and introduce All right, we're about to check out Nat King Cole and Natalie Cole. This is unforgettable. Yeah. Unforgettable. That's what you are. Unforgettable Though near or far Like a song of love That clings to me How the thought of you Does things to me Never before has someone been more unforgettable in every way? And forevermore, and forevermore, that's how you stay. That's why, darling, it's incredible that someone so unforgettable thinks that I am unforgettable too. Oh my gosh! This song, this this is probably one of the songs that that will like get me teary eyed. How cool like, is that though? Like, easily. That she did this whole song, like with her father, she actually sung. So he was actually like a was he a, a really big singer as well? Absolutely. Wow. Yeah, he yeah yeah he's like the original uh, to this song. So after he had passed away, I believe they did this like mashup song. Oh, so she's like singing over him, like singing yeah, kind of behind so. him. Yeah. No way. Yeah, because I'm yeah Nat King Cole. I think he did this song back in like what like the 40s or the 50s. Really? Like somewhere back in there. Wow. And and it just has like just such a. a um, an unforgettable sound at the end of the day. It, it's like one of those vibes that are... It is. It's one of those vibes and it's one of those songs and just lyrically too, it's a song that's just unforgettable. That's that, that, I feel like that's like the uh, the ironic part of this song is like when you hear it, 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 it does that to you. It's unforgettable like wow. when you listen to it. Mm. Okay. Yeah, this is... Good. A historical song yeah. for me. too so so <sighs> so was the original of that song 
him singing what he was singing? Just by himself. By himself? Yeah. So it's like she added herself on to... The, like, it sounded like it went together, though. Right, don't it? It, it sounded like it, and like it, that's supposed and it to, feel like it, yeah, too. Yeah, mm -hmm. that's the way it's supposed to be. Like, the fact that she was kind of singing, it was almost... <coughs> how did she do that? Uh, because, it, because it was meant to be. That's her dad. You know what I mean? It, it, just, it was just meant to be that way. Well, I'm just yeah. trying to think... Uh, I'm just trying to think... I guess in a, from a recording standpoint, like for her to go in there and do that with the timing of it, because mm -hmm. it almost sounded like obviously he was singing behind. It her. almost seemed like they were singing at the same time. Yeah. yeah, so that's why I was like, and it still sounded right. I feel like that would be really, really technical to do in a sense, like and make it sound good. Maybe not for her, just just for the simple fact that's her dad, and like after he had passed away and she did the song, it was almost like he probably they when she recorded it, it probably was like. It felt probably felt to her like they like he was in there singing with her. Maybe because you know? I yeah I'm gonna have to hear the song without him, without her on it mm -hmm. <laughs> to see how it sounded because I'm like how how did it even sound right without her on there like gotcha. that? Just because that's how good it sounded. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Man, what a beautiful song, though. This this kind of reminds me of like you know how you walk outside with an umbrella, it's raining. You know you're trying to be all romantic and everything and holding hands. <laughs> Holding hands Put and your, stuff like putting that. Your, putting your coat over the puddle. Yeah, yeah. So she, yeah, so she don't get her shoes wet <laughs> type of vibe. Like, that's kind of... <laughs> this little fairy tale fantasy in my mind of, like, how this song makes me envision... Make you just feel like, uh, regarding, like, love yeah. to a degree. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, again, like I said, I feel like this song is, like, one of those songs, a, a, a childhood favorite for me. <laughs> I know just being young and I would hear... Heard this being played. Yeah, I literally would like wish that like either my mom or whoever was playing it, they could just replay it and play it again because it yeah. was it was that type of sound. Some right here, and it always it was it was always just like a favorite of mine hearing that King Cole. Like I just remember hearing him watching watching him on Channel Thirteen sometimes, like performing. Yeah, like I've seen him perform this song before. So I mean, this is like a, a favorite of mine. Yeah, yeah, I, 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 I just love everything about the song. Yeah, I do yeah. too. This was really nice. Kind of give yeah. you that little, yeah, I love it, y'all. I just with, told y'all. And, like, and, and then, like you said, with, with her doing her rendition or really them doing like a duet, uh, you were saying how it sounds like they're both like singing at the same time or singing together. Yeah. That's probably exactly what was happening when she was in the studio singing it. Like, he was there singing with her in spirit, you yeah. know? That's why the song came out was so magical <laughs> and sounded the way that it sounded because it, it was just spot on. You're it, right it's with like that. A, it's like a perfect song yeah. for whatever, you know, I don't even know like whatever... Your life, you know, whatever suits your lifestyle, but just this song about just something being unforgettable. Yeah, you know. Okay. Something. I would agree. As precious as love, especially that. You know yeah, what I mean? Oh, okay, okay. Custom your body.